Welcome back. Your time is now 6.50. If you're shopping for a pet, look no further. The Harlingen Humane Society has all kinds of cute animals looking for a new home. Kim Warnick is joining us now, and this is George. Tell us all about George. So cute. He <laughs> is. He is a super happy, super friendly little puppy. He's about six months old, so um, perfect to go into a new home. Great with little kids, great with other pets. He is like the perfect little dog. We think he's a, a Chihuahua, maybe Jack Russell, Chihuahua, maybe Rat Terrier mix. Um, going to be active, going to be a little puppy crazy for a while, but he'd be great in a home with some kids. Definitely some kids because he needs to be chased around. He he loves it here. He's having a lot of fun. <laughs> um, so tell us a little bit about some of the programs you still have going on. We we're talking off air about that. There's still a lot of animals that are being brought in, and um, you're really encouraging people to spay and neuter their animals. We really are. We've got the low cost spay and neuter clinic available. Um, we're offering a voucher program for low income families. So there's really absolutely no excuse for you to allow your pet to have puppies and kittens when there's not homes for the ones that we already have. And, and you also have the program for military members as well, right? Um, we do. We've got the adoption program for military members, but we're also offering a discount from the spay neuter if they have their DD 214s. Good. So, like you said, I mean, this is very low cost, so people can get their animals spayed and neuter. And is there um, any other animals that they have there that, along with George, that need a loving home? Of course, all of them do, but. All of them do. We're at capacity, which is normally the case for us. So we've got somewhere in the neighborhood of about 160 animals in there right now and no stopping the animals coming in. So rather than purchasing off Craigslist or buying off Facebook, think about adopting. You get a lot with adoption packages, the spay neuters included, microchip, the vaccines. Um, you know, you've got your best shot at getting a pet for a really reasonable price. And that's the thing, I mean, the, the animals are at a good price for people to adopt. So if you can't go and buy, I mean, if you go to the store, I mean, they're hundreds of dollars to adopt. You're not going to spend a fortune. They, yeah, that's exactly right. And they come with their, you know, their pretty good start. So you're not going out and spending hundreds of dollars at a veterinarian right after a purchase. Out of curiosity, why do chihuahuas shiver so much? <laughs> Every um, chihuahua we have, even my chihuahua shivers. Yeah, they're, they're a little bit of a nervous breed. That's kind of a nervous energy thing that you see with them. It's not that they're cold. It's, it's kind of more of a stress reaction. Yeah. Right now, he finally stopped shaking, so I think he's happy with us. He's settled in. He is. He'd like to get down and run around and tear everything up. <laughs> he would, so we definitely want to make sure the family that gets him, like we said earlier, have some kids to chase him around because... You need a lot of energy, yes, George. We need lots of energy to take care of you. <laughs> and Kim, thank you so much for bringing George here this morning. We hope by next week he has a new home. And if you want to find more information, you can call 425-PAUSE if you want more information about any pets that you have at the shelter. Right? Absolutely, or stop on in and take a look. There's no shortage of cuties in there. Yeah, I can do some window shopping and hopefully get one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Kim. Thank you, Kim. Thank well, you. your time now is about 654. Still to come on Action Force Sunrise, we'll have another look at today's top stories. And your out-the-door forecast for your Tuesday. Stay with us.